Uh, hello, everyone. Round one. Uh, he's on the play. We both kept up. Rock and roll. Swamp. Pass. Uh, turn. We will play a down of the bugbear. Mm -hmm. Pass. Swamp. Tap one. Play a foul mire knight. Okay. And pass you. Drop turn. Play a layer of the hydra. Mm -hmm. And I will pay two. I'm going to play measure of royal bodyguard. All right. I'm going to fatal push him. Okay. And I will pass her. Castle. Tap three to play the Dire Graph. Uh, he gets no plus ones because there's no Zombos in the graveyard. We'll swing for one. Take one. 19. Pass to you. Uh, we'll play a Stomping Ground Tap as my for turn. And I will pay two and play a Bard class. Mm -hmm. Legendary creatures that control, I, I, was, yeah, I control Iron Battlefield. A, an additional one more counter on them, and then um, if you'd like to read it. I see it in arena every now and then. Legendary spells and cast costs less. This factor is the only amount of color mana. Yep. And pass her. Right. Untap. Draw. Play another swamp. Tap four, play a shieldred. Yeah, good card. And then we swing for three. All right, I have no blocks, take three. Go to 16. We'll pass you. And tap, draw. Lose two. Uh, yes, go to 14. Um, I will pay two, and I will level up bard class. Mm -hmm. So it is it's basically free. Yeah, free level up. Yeah. So. So good. It's always weird because it doesn't say it's level one, but anyways. Um, yeah, so now my leg uh, legendary spells I cast cost two color less. So we're yeah. going to start with playing a Azure. Yep. We're going to play a Tartanar. Yep. Uh, Galia. Mm -hmm. We're going to pay one and play a Miklos. Mm -hmm. And... Um, you know what? If you have a board wipe, you have a board wipe. We'll go ahead and play an Agatha as well. And so they all enter with one one counters. Yeah. Uh, only she has haste. Even on level two, they enter with counters. Uh, that's the static ability. Static. Okay. Yep. Yeah, the fifth of uh, level three, uh, five mana. Whenever I cast a legendary spell, exile the top two cards in my library, I may play them this turn. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't feel like running into shield trade for nothing, so pass turn. Okay. We untap, we draw, we gain two life. Who's dangerous over here? Yes. Yes, <laughs> yeah. Uh, other satyrs get 1-1. One, one. Uh, activate the abilities you control. Cost X less to activate. Uh, or X is his power, so activate cost 2 less. Double that guy's power until end of turn. Sacrifice some legendary creatures that you get indestructible. Oh, Yes, indeed. Yeah. I think we tap three, send the rider on an adventure, and kill him. Okay, so in response, I will sack him to give creatures, electric creatures that control plus one plus only indestructible on the turn. Okay. I lose two life for that. 
tap one, we'll play a Crypt Breaker. He will make a token. <laughs> he doesn't even have his own cards. That comes in tapped. Um, and then... I don't think we can really swing, but you're also going to do a lot of damage. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I want to sacrifice shield. So I think we. Faster. Okay. Untap. Draw. Lose two. Lose two. Land for turn. Now. You know what? It's the first time I'm out with it. Let's just do it. We will go combat, mm -hmm. and I will flunge. So, trigger pack tactics. Okay. Whenever Targnar attacks with creatures total power six or greater, mm -hmm. ten creatures I control get plus one plus zero until end of turn. Okay. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Okay, so I think we probably block there with that guy, and then. So these, they get plus one? Yes, plus one plus okay, one. So the, these are all, <laughs> let's see, so it's four, four, three? Yep. I have one. Nice. All of Jamaica's lands. <laughs> nice. Surprise. The reason I play that is like, like one. The Vesaju makes eight. I'll give you a little time. I don't <laughs> have another red land. Yeah, yeah. Spells are cast, like, so okay, it's just from our hand. Right, but the legendary spells yes, cast. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, I did. By the way, there was an attack trigger where we passed it, so okay. it's a May. Okay. That's why I was asking if I I could draw two, but mm. lose four from Shieldred. Mm. True. I think that we do that. So three, he's a four. Shieldred, that is with one. Death touch there. He hangs back. Oh, this is okay. Yes. Three, four, four, and three, seven coming through. Yep. Okay, so that's a box? Yes. Okay, so I will pay three because it costs three less because she's power three to activate her own ability, mm -hmm. giving these three plus one plus one and trample. Okay. In haste, but. Mm -hmm. um, and. Uh, I don't have anything else I can do with that, so. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, trade, trade, take four, uh, take, sorry, uh, this is five, six, seven, so take six from this. Six, yep. Uh, this is three, four, five, nothing there. Mm -hmm. And then this is five as well, so 11, 14, because it's plus three, 14. So I go to six. Cool. Uh, these two are dead. And I will pass her. Oof. You're killing me. Play another Go for the throw. Okay. I think we pay one and cast Foul Mire. Okay. Make a token. And then. Yeah, I gotta attack because they're gonna kill me 
I mean, at least a turn or two, but how much do I leave up in defense? Three, four. So we'll die. Yeah, I guess we just swing with uh, the diagraph. Yep, we just swing for two. Okay. Take two. Mm -hmm. Go to ten. On top. Draw. Copper line gorge as land for turn tapped. Uh, I'm going to pay. Yeah, that's right. Uh, three mm -hmm. and only one reduced point of questing beast. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't want Golly to die, so combat oh, comes with one more counter because it is legendary. Mm -hmm. Go to combat, mm -hmm. swing a 5 5 vigilance death touch that cannot be blocked by creatures of power two or less. Two or less, I got no box then. All right. I, I take five, I go to one. Yep. Pass turn. Send seven at you. Okay. I will put Golly in front of one of the two two zombies. Okay. And then that'll be five. Yep. We tap one. Yep. We push him. I mean, I have zero. All I have is seven lanes. And we say go. Okay. Your zero cards I hand? Yeah. If you don't top deck a kill spell, you don't have lethal on board. If Galia is still alive. Yes, and then you used it to Right. Okay. So I have to use this I have to do this stupid risky. I'm gonna pay five and level up bird class. Okay. That's what I was just like, wait. Uh, I mean, whenever I cast a legendary spell, I exile the top two cards in my library and play them until I uh, play them as turn. Okay. And I'm going to pass turn. All right. And hope you don't draw a kill spell. I haven't found a single creature besides that. Those two murder spiders. It's a muta. Does not have haste. Does not have haste. Or what's her shielders, which would have killed you by now. All right. Whenever you cast a legendary spell, exile. Yep. Anyway, I may or may not have a trample, so I guess we save him. 
and pass. Okay. I, was, I, I honestly don't know the right answer for you either. <laughs> I, 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 to be fair, this turn could be big, it could be small. Well, but we will start by paying one. Mm -hmm. We're going to play a Domri Anarcho Yep. Uh, it's a fight. It's okay. not a one sided fight, so I couldn't kill your one untapped creature and still attack you. Okay. I'd actually die. So, anyways, it comes out with three counters. Um, I'm going to actually up it. Not that I don't think it matters this, but creature spell, I get one, uh, I'm floating a red. Okay. And creature spells I cast a turn can't be um, covered. Okay. Uh, well, that is unfortunate. So, I'm going to pay three, play a mirror box. Mm -hmm. Legend rule doesn't apply permits I control. Each legendary creature I control gets plus one, plus one. Each non-token uh, creature you control gets plus one, plus one for each other creature you control with the same name. Uh, oh, I guess I should have actually, sorry. That's okay. Mm -hmm. Use the floating red rather than that. Mm -hmm. uh, this will end up being exiled because I already played land for turn. And, yes. And, uh, unfortunately, I didn't get anything to do anything, so pass the turn. Yeah. Yeah. Like me, just like Oh. I'm a dumbass. <laughs> you see it? YouTube's gonna kill me for two turns ago when I could have killed you when you had two creatures and I had five lands untapped and a layer of the Hydra and a pin on the bugbear. That's okay. I figured it was gonna be a learning lesson. I wanted to say something, I was like, if he sees it, I'm dead. To be fair, it's what I'm I, I've been waiting months to get a layer of the Hydra and I just got it. <laughs> <laughs> but you'll never forget it again now. Nope. Um, I think I have enough. I bring Probably. out the Muta. Two, four, six, seven, eight. Yeah, and I can only put one, and I left the wrong land up, so. <laughs> yeah, you got it. Oh, man. I feel bad about that one. Oh, no. Look, that's the first time I piloted the deck, too, so I don't feel bad. It's like, this is one of those things that when you're looking at your lands again, as you're doing other things, like, oh, crap. <laughs> It's like if he sees the layer, if he sees the layer or the den. Yeah, I think, I, I think you to, could have activated either of them. And, yep. and, uh, uh, the, the den would have been better because I actually could have activated the den, I think, maybe a turn earlier, too. No, probably not. That's a good point. Yeah, I was just more of the Go easy, YouTube. <laughs> First time piloting the deck. We all know how that is. I don't this week, but I would have brought stuff had I known. Do you guys have three rats by the chance? Neither of us do, but we're also on camera right now. Okay, so. And, uh. I'll be able to play. I imagine so. Seems to be the popular choice. Tends to be. <laughs> to be fair, if my opponent ever said they were going to go with the draw, I would be thoroughly concerned. 
I played, uh, man, there was one guy I played, maybe it was at a an event here or something, but he, or maybe it was, no, it was a um, pre-release. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and he always went on the play. I can't remember who he was, because he was like, pre-release, you want to see more cards, because decks are kind of janky anyway, they're yeah. slow, like, unless you're actually playing, trying to play a red aggro, which you can't really do in pre-release. You can, you can sometimes do, like, a Boros when it's there, but, yeah. yeah. If it's not a, a themed archetype, an aggro archetype, it's just not going to work out. Yeah. It makes sense there. No, sorry. Oh, you're good. I had a top of green order for a red and white Camera nerve. I didn't know the latest, but I did. I was just like, oh, Boulder Lodge. Next time we just cut. I cannot keep that. I will keep. Whenever a player casts a spell, but it can I feel like I say this every week, but it is much nicer to shuffle 60 cards instead of 100. 100. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing how much easier it is. Like 100, you're just kind of fumbling. and It's just big enough where it's outside of most people's normal hand size. Yeah. Okay, I can keep this. And I think... This one at the bottom. All right, you good? Yep. All right, I am going to go ahead and start by playing a Crag Crown Pathway. Last turn. Draw a card. Play a swamp. I will tap it and play Thoughts. Oh, I will take the Bard class. Rough. <laughs> You, uh, uh, or, if you okay. mind, don't mind playing up. It's, yeah. it's, well, yeah, we'll they, they can face you if you want. I was wondering where we want to leave them. Mostly them here for now. Sure. It's th they're not going to stay there long. <laughs> True. There you go. That's what everybody else usually does. So. I just don't want to get mixed with the, the field because mm -hmm. it's, yep. it's not going to be long. Yes. My turn? Yeah. Right, drop the turn. Layer the Hydra as land for turn. Mm -hmm. Agatha. Mm -hmm. Mox Amber? Yeah. Uh, and then I will pass her. <laughs> tap, draw. Play a swamp. We will tap one swamp. Play one Crypt Breaker. We will tap another swamp. We'll play a second one. Cool. And uh, we pass turn. All right. Untap. Draw. Uh, we will pay three mm -hmm. for a Rada. Mm -hmm. There they are. Uh, <laughs> As long as it's my turn, she has first strike, but I may look at the top card of my library and this land, I may play it. Uh, I will play a Blue Sage in this land for turn. Okay. Uh, Good sequence. Did you want to see that yeah, land? Mm -hmm. Agatha is a 1 1, so I will pass her. Yep. Tap. Play castle. I can't target that. We tap three and play Death Baron. Cool. Everybody else gets plus one, plus one, and Death Touch. Um, and we pass. Okay. Draw. I'll play a Blue Sun Forest as land for turn. We will pay uh, Colorless on the conclusion mm -hmm. four. Okay. And we will play a Questing Beast. Questing Beast. Go to combat. <laughs> yes. 
swing a Rada and a questing beast at you. Okay. 3-3 three, three first strike, and can you block the creature's power two or less? 3-3 three, three and four, four, so seven coming at me. Yep. So I think I have to eat the seven. Go to 11. All right. Um, you're done? Yep. Okay. Yep, on your end yep. step, I'm going to yep. tap three zombies, draw a card, go to 10. Nice. Uh, that. Play children. Seems good. We probably should have swung the first time around. So I think we have to swing now. Peace. So we get those two guys for four damage. Okay. No box. I'll mm -hmm. take four. Mm -hmm. So 16. Uh, and then we. Pass turn to you. Draw. Shoulder oh. pain. So I know it's annoying. Eh, it just seems, you would just forget about it. It's just convenient for me. So yeah, I'm going to uh, pay four. To activate, or sorry, pay five mm -hmm. to activate Agatha. Mm -hmm. Other creatures I control with plus one, plus one, tra uh, trample and haste. Yeah. Go to combat. Okay. Swing with the two. So yeah. five, five, can't be blocked, two or less, and a four, four for a strike. Yeah. Like, I wanted to be able to play that out. We'll shoot. She's a four. Yep. Something. Four first. Four four first strike. Yeah. So sure. And haste. Yeah, I could have, I could and trample. Like, <laughs> right. Well, what's that? Right. Yeah. Five. And then jumping with the one with the next one. And then I had another. Okay. Yeah. And then I just tapped out. out. Yeah. And then ran into block with her three. next turn, like, so I can't attack with her. That's a bummer. Well, my opener okay. was. Um. Five, so we would trade, and then I would just I want four, next one's a four, five. Yeah, so I think we have a block here. Okay. So, Rada will die. Uh, Questing Beast will hit you for five. I'll go to five. You still don't have a Planeswalker, so I still can't do anything with that. And we will pass her. Um, let's so do I die next turn? Anyway, no, not necessarily. Plus one, plus one, uh, and trample and yeah, haste. So when you drop somebody, they can haste. Debating the castle, but then I go to two, and then if I die next turn anyway, it doesn't particularly matter. So I guess I go to four with her. Um. Yeah, I think we just do it. So on your end step, we mm -hmm. play the four, we tap, we draw a card. Uh, I guess we only lose one, so we draw a card, we gain two, but we lose three, so we go to four. All right, that makes life a little bit better. Now we untap, now we draw, now we go to six. And that was the problem when you hit that. Yeah. When you had so when you hit Coco, you play the Muda. Yep. As long as you hit Copper Coco, I can hit both things. Yeah. As soon as you hit Copper Coco, I'm like, again, it's a swamp to push that. I think the right call is pass. 
Those guys can't block anyway, so. Yeah. Well, Stormseeker's the question. Well, because you're on your end step. And so, then whatever I talk to. Swing that, for. Right, and that's what I was trying to figure out. Is it right to do that? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, and I just figured, okay. I have a layer of the Hydra. So your Hydra's coming at me. One, two, three, four on the Hydra. Or there. So I need one block. I know you didn't forget. No, I just always wish I had some <laughs> ability with it other than just becoming a big boy. That's all. Um, like Menace or Trample or something making it a little more threatening. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think we just swing for four. Okay. Uh, they are death touches, correct? Yeah, two two with death touch. No blocks. I'll go two ten. Okay. So and then okay. past you. Go tap. Take two as a draw. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. And I topped the land that I wanted. I'm really missing the bar class. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. It has to have uh, better colors this way. Uh, green, red. I don't think that can tap for Oh, sorry. Um, well, it's not. We'll do it this way then. Mm -hmm. Samut. Yep. Green, red, Galaga. Yes. Uh, <clears throat> you still have a shielded, which really is annoying. Go to combat. Yeah. Flunge is the only one that taps. Okay. So, 2 3 first strike vigilance, 4 4 vigilance death touch, and a 2 2. And I will not discard a card and draw two cards. Okay, so. 2 2? Yes. Other saviors get plus one plus one. I don't have any of saviors. This is a 2 3? Yes. First strike. And also, whenever a creature I control that deals, uh, deals combat damage to a player, if that creature ends the battlefield this turn, I draw a card. Mm hmm. Oh, wait, no, never mind. Four. Sorry, Candy Trail draws a card because it's way better food than food. Uh, I had to block two of them, one way or another. What? He's going to die one way or another. So I think I, he's a 2 2, right? Yeah, nothing else exciting. Uh, uh, haste, other sayers get 1 1 haste, and whenever I attack with three or more creatures, I may discard a card if I do, at random if I do draw. Yeah. So I think these are our blocks, and then there's just a 4 4 coming through. Three percent. Yeah. Right, we doing my whole deck. That card's the mail. Didn't think I was getting them until tomorrow. Uh, yep. Cool. Box there. Yep. So, trade. Yep. Dies, and you'll take four. Go down to two. Yep. Which means I cannot activate the castle. And then that's right. Two from the shield, right? Go to four. Oh, this, mm -hmm. this, uh, mm -hmm. No matter what, I just have to uh, tap for the Muda. Four, five, six, seven, eight, so. Quite enough. <laughs> you, you block there, you only tick. Well, no, I think that is enough, right? Unless you block the shield grid. And then they trade. Or I just leave shield grid up. So if 
I tap out, I'm doing two, three, four. They are just one once. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yep. But I remember thinking, oh, it was like a 23 yard card. That's just four damage. You trade the Okay, I'd, I'd forgotten. I'd been doing all the math of them being two twos. Mm. Oh. Yeah, yeah. With that touch. Yeah. He's he's gone, though. No, yeah, I feel a little more comfortable about <laughs> Not greatly, just a little. I'm sure I know it's in your hand, and I'm still not on all of it. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna tap four. We're gonna channel Takanuma. Yeah. To bring back the Death Baron. Uh, yeah, discard oh. him. Mill. Th uh, you need mill three, right? First. Oh yeah. So I will tap three because I have Shieldred out. Uh, cost one less for each legendary. Yeah. Mill three cards. Who knows? Maybe you get something you want more. I think I can only return a Permanent. creature or a planes oh, creature. Okay. okay. So I think I return yep. the Death Baron. I have black, black. So I do that, and then four, mm -hmm. five, six, seven, eight. And someday, probably. has got Death Touch. I still have yeah. a blocker. <laughs> that seems a lot. This is four. I have two blockers. Yeah. The other way, I have to. Yeah, so yeah, 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 One card in hand. One card in hand. Yeah, I think we just swing for four. Swing for four. Two two okay. with that touchers. No box. They have put quite a bit of work in. Yeah, they have. Sixteen damage worth. <laughs> and then we Cool. I guess not sixteen. Shoulder putting some. Yeah. Untap. Heart of the cards. We go to two from shoulder. Yeah. yeah it's, uh, it had just be any legendary that wasn't the same one that was already in my hand. <laughs> oh no. Um red and the green. Mm -hmm. Ruby. Mm -hmm. And because I, at this point, let's see. I have to force you to try to block everything, but then I just don't have anything back and left. I think you got it, but let's just see. Go to combat, okay. swing these two. She, because they're swinging together, she, well, because he's power four or greater, mm -hmm. she's going to get plus two, plus two. So she's a three, four. Okay. And he's still a four, four. Four, four. Can't be bought. Creature two, power two plus. Yeah. So I'd have to trade there. Oh, and then she's a uh, three, uh, three, four. Yep. Three, four. Do you have any way to do one damage? I wish I knew that deck better. I still have mana left. I feel like I... What if I block... There, she's tapped. So, I have two. So yeah, I, I have to... I have to block there. Just double checking. We're still two, and I can't do both because the stakes are green. There's a ruby hand. <laughs> you got it. Oh my gosh. Close one. It, I, if I hit a Galia, I probably could have gotten through. But, yeah. Because then I would have still been able to do the Hydra and had four attackers. Mm. Or three attackers, sorry. Three yep. real. You, just, you know, four attackers, yeah. You just needed one more. <laughs> Close games. Yeah. Good games? And that, you had me the first game, so I feel a little, I, a little bit bad taking it. Oh, I punted. It's my bad. Well, that was that.